thought I'd do a little walk around of my uh, Mustang here. Doing a lot of work on it this week. Absolutely beautiful day. So, getting a good start on it. On it. Uh, somebody said, need to put some new fuel injectors in it. Well, it's got new fuel injectors in it. Those black ones right there, if you can see that. And here's some I've used over the years. I've got 19 pounds and 24 pounds. Different types. I've used them all here. And uh, need to break down and get some uh, trick flow. They're 329 bucks for the uh, set of eight. And I'm going to do that. But anyway, I uh, wanted to show you how the wiring's turning out here. Now, if you notice here, just a few little tiny wires here, right? That's nothing to me. Now, those are will be moved under the fender well. A few right here, you won't be seeing those. Used to go under the battery there, out to the lights and all that. Be moved under the fender well. A lot of the wires poke through here. Not finished here. I'll clean this up. Make some kind of grommet, maybe. Okay, but if you notice... Uh, mass air or the map sensor right here sneaks through a little hole there used to have some wires run to it Salt and pepper shaker right here. That's what those are called 10 pin connectors are up on the firewall They're usually attached right here, but I have an aftermarket uh, Intake right here. So that's what I wanted to do with them Injectors are looking good injector harness is new or newer uh, okay over here everything's cleaning up I have some wire looms I'm gonna put on this when I finally finish it all up uh, very few wires coming through here normally on this type car you got a big fat harness here big fat cables here you got a big fat cable running over here all that's gone nice and clean that's just a little tidying up my uh, mass air sensor right here mass air flow sensor wires are tucked under the fender well sits down in there a little farther throttle position sensor clean that up a little bit it's all nice brand new uh, throttle cable there now in here might look like a mess to you but any wires that were not used I removed them. I won't have a dome light. All I'm going to have is a dashboard and uh, the gauge is right there. No radiator. Uh, radio, I don't even care. But wires like this used to have, had lots of wires in them. Now I've got it down to two. Got to have these two. I think that might be the fuel pump. Okay, clean all this up. Look at that wiring on it. I do anything I want to with it. That's needed. That's the uh, for blower motor. Heat's going to work really good. New heater core is going in. All this right here used to be a huge. Now it's down to that. I'll tidy all that up. The computer goes right here. Factory place. Heavy ground right there. Uh, back seats. First time they've ever been out. Don't think they'll ever go back in. Don't need them. Nobody sat back there for a long time. I'll have just two. There'll be a two-seater. Back here, I removed all the speaker wire. Any wires that weren't necessary. I used to have a little uh, light right here, interior light when you open the hatch. I don't need it. It's gone. Actually, I'll take that little plug out of there. And I'll tidy all this up. Nothing to it. That's all you got. Now, all these are necessary. This little plug here, I don't know what that is. I may get rid of this. Some ground wires. Some more wires I'm getting rid of what I'm doing this for. Nothing here now. Okay, easy to wrap that up. And that's about it. Car will start right up, runs really good. Here's the way the wiring mouse looks. And that's it for now.